In this tutorial I'll show you the pre-roll feature of the eSampler. With this feature you can create pre-roll notes. And with a pre-roll note you can show the context of a video sample. I'll show you an example of when this is useful. On this MIDI track I have an eSampler loaded with a sample of a pumpkin getting hit by a hammer. So when I set the start time I obviously set it at the time where the sound starts. But when I trigger it, I then miss an essential part of the sample visually. I miss the pumpkin and I miss the hammer heading towards the pumpkin. To, so to fix that I can easily add a pre-roll note to show that part. So to add a pre-roll note just add a MIDI note and set its velocity to zero. Now it's a pre-roll note, or actually set it to 1. Now it's a pre-roll note. And just add that note in front of your original note. Now set a pre-roll time with this pre-roll dial. I set my pre-roll time to minus one half of a second. And so when I now play this MIDI clip, you'll see that this pre-roll note is now triggering the same sample but with an offset. With an earlier start point that starts uh, a half a second before the original start point and in that way showing the part leading up to the sample. It will only play back the sound of uh, the visual, not the sound. And in that way I can show the moments leading up to the sample. So in that way you can make a video rhythm uh, or your visual edit more interesting. This is an example of a simple video rhythm without pre-roll notes and this with a pre-roll note. So that's visually more interesting. Alright, so that's the pre-roll note. Sweet, 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 sweet